bloody hell. There's a thousand of you now. God, that sounds good to say. How you doing? Oh, I can actually, oh, that's weird, I talk on a talk. Let's, uh, let's just lower you down here. So, g'day mates. Don't worry, this won't be the only part of the video. This is just a nice little intro, because I bloody love this view. I mean, look at that. Uh, you actually... I have just realised you're seeing this, not... Uh, hang on, let's give you a shot. Let's selfie this. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's just beautiful. Now look, look at this landscape behind me. Oh, it's lovely. <laughs> Fucking hell. This is bloody stupid. I love it. So, uh, yeah, I think let's switch up to stage two then. See you in a bit. All right, now we're back in the real world. Yeah, there we sort of. So uh, let me just show you my mug. Wordplay. Fuck. A thousand of ya. That's, um, that's pretty bloody nice. You know, it's a good feeling. But, you know, now we've obviously got to do something because apparently you're meant to do something when you achieve things, you know, like a celebration of sorts. So, you know, YouTube standard, must go by the standard rules, must do with some sort of challenge. So we'll do the tea challenge. Have to drink tea without sounding British. So, you know, just... Oh, bugger. Fuck. Uh, right. Well, we've already failed that. So let's uh, move on now that shit's out of the way. You might be wondering why we're staring at Discord. Lovely question. You know, just perfect question. Really good timing on asking that one. We're staring at Discord because uh, I've decided to set up a little thing, right? I bloody, I love Discord. Discord is, it's beautiful. It's lovely. It's great. Uh, the reason why I love it is that you can pretty much just hop on and chat with people and... I think the weirdest thing I've got was the, uh, is the... Oh, hang on, I think I can just show you. Can't I? Here we are. The looking for gamers one. Look how many people there are. I just hop on and be like, yo, how you doing? And people are like, oh, fuck yeah, it's just good for a chat. It's good fun. It's sort of what TeamSpeak lacked, honestly, was just the ability to jump into random servers. It was quite fun. Uh, well, I mean, I guess there were a few, but TeamSpeak was never as good as this. I love it. Anyway, so, the whole point is I've made up this little Discord. It's called The Land Down Under, so you can see... General rules here, don't be a cunt. And there's the uh, little thing, I'll whack that, uh, what's called the login, fuck, not the login, the connection link here, there, and everywhere. Uh, just, yeah, pretty much for everyone to hop on in, join in, make it a bit of a sub shack of sorts, and uh, just play some bloody games. Because you know what, I bloody love multiplayer, and it's good to always have more people to play with. And I'm sure there's have to configure the AFK channel, because I haven't done that. Well, I'll we'll do that in a moment. Anyway, so uh, past that, you know, it's sort of uh, the videos I'm going to be doing in the next few days, hopefully. I'll get some of you in for a bit of a multiplayer game, have some fun with that, because uh, Together for Victory is really bloody good. Uh, but apart from that, obviously Hearts of Iron for days and days and days, because bloody hell I love that game. Probably one of my favourite games. Oh. I'm, I'm, I'm tossing up. It's it's up there. It's pretty up there. I can play that game for a long, long time. Uh, with a lot of mods too. The mods add a lot of stuff. That, uh, it's quite bloody fun. Although I need to uh, test the Xword AI mod. That that mod was pretty good when the with the vanilla. I'm not sure how it works with uh, Together for Victory. So, um, apart from that, yeah, you know, you've got the Hearts of Iron. Now, secondly, I've got my little list here. That's why I keep glancing off to the side. Camera's up here. Come on. TV 101. Uh, little series I want to do. So, for me, I always love the idea of live streaming, right? Live, live streaming is uh, it's pretty bloody good. It's, it's like a, something nice about connecting with an audience. Uh, problem is, I'm in Australia. So, unless I can find a workaround, or boost my net somehow, or just find some other way to do it, my net is just too shite to live stream. Because, uh, I don't know. I like doing improv, I like jokes on, like, run on, because edited jokes are hilarious, but so are the ones I just come with as a, uh, as a sort of role, you know, it's, it's good fun. But, uh, unless you want to see it, you know, in 480p, like some sort of peasant, uh, you pretty much have to not watch my live stream, because my net is shite. Welcome to Australia. It's horrendous. I'm downloading a game at like 600 kilobytes right now, and that's like good. That's good. That's peak. I think most I've ever seen is 700. Somehow though, Mate Two Suburbs Over has two megabytes, which I still think is like nothing for a lot of people. Anyway, I'll, I'll stop bitching about Australian net for all the two seconds and introduce the series I'll be doing. So, pretty much, uh, the whole point is that I want to do some more long form stuff that don't really make good uh, edited videos or don't have something to constantly talk about, like Hearts of Iron. Weirdly enough, that game always has something to talk about. Because, you know, I'll, I'll often go off on tangents in that game and be like, oh, and then this thing happened, and then like five seconds later, I've got 30 pop-ups going, hey, you should pay attention, hey, you should pay attention. I was like, ah, shit. There's a lot of games. And I think what I'm going to do is make a little thing uh, called Relaxing with Rimmy, because I want it to be as awkward as possible to talk about. Like, it, it sh you should not be able to mention this to someone. It'd be great. It was originally going to be Relaxing with a Rimmy, so... We'll see, I'll build a little title card for that, because it's going to be good fun. 
But basically, it'll be like some longer form games, sort of in a podcast style, you know, where I just talk and talk and tell stories and stuff whilst playing something. So the first game for that will be uh, the new RimWorld update. I bloody love RimWorld. Great game. It's like Dwarf Fortress if it was actually playable into the later stages. Um, so yeah, apart from that, uh, do some other stuff. You know, Actually, the new Walking Dead game, I'm going to start playing that. That will probably just be a normal series. Um, what else? There's Shogun Tactics, which I'm looking into. That game looks amazing. Really rough, really fun. Um, but all that sort of stuff. And the other thing is, since I want to sort of do it as a podcast stuff, you know, it'll be all nice and relaxing. It won't be sort of upbeat. It'll be like, yo, how you doing? Let's drink some tea. Weirdly sexual tea. Right. Um, so, yeah, no, apart from that, I want to sort of rope in some people. Maybe rope in Scott, someone from else, uh, someone else from real life. You know, just get some podcast in. Help get you a lot from the Discord. Get some other Discords. <laughs> Maybe I'll just go hang out and looking for gamers and, like, rope random people in. But either way, it'll just be good fun, relaxing having a good old bloody time and uh what else hang on i've got my little menu thing here oh of course yes uh just started playing only war new lovely bloody uh well it's not new but anyway um new for us uh tabletop rpg with my mates right so i've, I've tried to record that before i don't like recording right uh, real life games unless it's like a proper setup and obviously like uh that's sort of, you know like uh what do you call them Roleplay, uh, it me JP. He's on Twitch. He does a lovely sort of live game. Unless it's something like that, or Critical Role, I think is live as well. Unless it's set up proper, everyone's into it. Trying to record a game is not all that fun. Um, recording games online is all right because you just record in the you know bish bash boss done. If it's good, it's good. If it's not, it's not. Like the uh, the bloody D and D game I'm doing, which sadly won't be doing for a little while because we've got bloody holidays. We've got Christmas and all that. Um, but that game, good fun, good fun. Everyone bounces off each other really well. It's a nice. It's a really quite a nice game, uh, D&D 5th, and everyone picked it up fairly quick. So anyway, apart from that, like that, obviously, uh, I kind of want to do some battle reports of our little Only War game, because it's so far fucking hilarious. Uh, I won't tell... I might tell the stories on Relaxing for Remy, but I, I feel like I should do a little battle report, you know, like, Dear Commissar, this is what has happened in the battle today. The priest died terribly. Oh, moving on. It was it was good, good fun, that game. God damn. Anyway, so... I think that's pretty much it. Yeah, we've got, you know, Only War Battle Reports. Uh, we've got Relaxing with Remy because you know you want to talk about it. Uh, we've got the Discord. Hey, look at it. There'll be links for all that stuff. And we had my lovely mug because I am some sort of tea rebel. Ugh, and also my head is horrible right now because I've just had me head in a bloody vibe. Although I do like it. I look like a bit of tank commander with these on. There we are. Forwards, men, into battle. So, uh, yeah. Until next time, everyone. I think I gotta get start working on this stuff because I've promised a fair bit, but uh, yeah, might as well deliver. <laughs> so thank you all very much for watching. I've been Remy. You all have a bloody good day now. Farewell.